Hi everybody, it's Stephen Tasser with Exit Realty and this is Ask the Expert. Today we're here with Kristen Campbell of Organized Homes and Staging in Waconia, Minnesota. She's a certified home stager and redesigner and for the last five years she's been providing home staging and organizing services in the seven county metro area of Minneapolis and St. Paul. We're in the third of a five part series on home staging and the importance of home staging to the home selling process. This video is going to be on neutralizing. Kristen, tell us about neutralizing and why it's so important for the staging process. Neutralizing is so important because today's typical buyer wants something that's move and ready. So by going through and neutralizing all the rooms in your house, this is going to really help set your house apart from some others that may need a lot of painting and that type of work. So it also um, sh doesn't allow for somebody to profile the family who is living there. This is why I always recommend removing all of your personal pictures. Um, pack away all of your religious items and political items as well. Make sure you pack away all collections. I know a lot of us like to collect things. We're very proud of them. However, that's just a way for somebody to try and figure out the family who's living there that takes the focus off of looking at the features of your house. They start imagining the people who are currently living there. So pack away those shot glass collections, your sports memorabilia, all of those items. Um, and then another topic under neutralizing is odors. Um, smoke is it's a turnoff it just is painting can help with that um, deep cleaning can help with that weather permitting open windows fresh air is the best smell out there um, pets we love our pets but you know they can uh, create some odors in our houses and we do tend to get accustomed to those odors so it is important to have a fresh person come in and give you their honest opinion of how your house is smelling. Um, same with cooking. People who cook a lot, especially if you're using a lot of spices and that sort of thing, it can sometimes kind of seep into the carpeting and the walls and that sort of thing. Again, painting and deep cleaning can help with that. Be sure to not try and mask any odors with any strong fragrances because that can be just as offensive to people so if you're gonna use a fragrance, use something light, like a clean linen scent. Um, by doing these things um, throughout the home staging process, it will just help make your house more move and ready for any potential buyers. The, the points that you've given me and others have given me in the past has been, you want to give them the ability to put their own view on the house. And it's not, like you said, not overwhelmed by the previous owner. You are correct. Excellent. Exactly. Help them to envision themselves in your house. If you found this video to be helpful, click on like below. If you want to see more videos as they come out, click on subscribe. If you have questions for either Kristen or I about this topic, please feel free to give us a call. Our information is listed in the description below. Thank you very much for listening and we'll see you next time.